Welcome to Read Along Kids! <laughs> hey there, Read Along Kids! Welcome back to another great adventure. Today's story is called When Your Elephant Has the Sniffles by Susanna Leonard Hill, illustrated by Daniel Wiseman. Sniff, sniff, sniffle. Uh-oh, does your elephant have the sniffles? Uh-huh. When your elephant has the sniffles, you must take good care of him. Elephant sniffles can be quite serious, and you don't want your elephant to start sneezing. Put him to bed even if he tells you he's just fine. If there's anything in the room that might make him sneeze, hide it. Then prop him up with lots of pillows and cover him with plenty of blankets. Bring him his favorite stuffed animal to snuggle with. At first, your elephant might not mind being tucked into bed. He might want another pillow. He might ask for his trucks. Then he might want you to bring him an ice pop. But after a while, he will get bored. So you will have to think of fun things to do. After all those fun things, you can make shadow puppets. Remember, rest is very important and you do not want your elephant to start sneezing. By now, your elephant will be thirsty. Bring him lots of liquids because those are important for fighting the sniffles. And you do not under any circumstances want your elephant to start sneezing. After the drinks, your elephant will probably announce that he's had quite enough and he's getting up. Distract him by dressing up and singing a song. But be careful what props you use. Because after all your hard work, his nose might begin to itch and twitch and ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, choo! Oh dear, when your elephant has the sniffles, you just might end up with them too. The end. Thanks for listening, Read Along Kids. Remember to like, share, and subscribe for more great read-along fun. Until next time, bye-bye.